Bernie Sanders now taking that CEO comp pay ratio and proposing a way to tax big companies uh, that have a big gap between those two. Joining us right now to talk about all of it and more, former SEC chair uh, Jay Clayton. He is now Apollo Global Management's non-executive chair and a CNBC contributor. And I want to go actually to the Bernie Sanders of it all before we talk about the Exxon piece, because it is something that was just uh, in the news literally uh, overnight. Um, there was some, and, and by the way, there was a big debate back when he first proposed this, back in 2000. 11 and 12. It was passed in 2013. Mm -hmm. And then there was a whole complaint for a long time that the SEC dragged its feet in implementing the rule, which was to, dis to create some transparency and disclosure around this ratio. Mm -hmm. Some people at the time had said, you know, uh, it's not just about transparency. At some point, someone like a Bernie Sanders is going to come in and say, either tax them on it or use it in some other way. What do you think is going to happen? What, what do I think is going to happen? Yes. Or, or what do I think about all Both. that? Both. Okay, so what I think about all that is the critics are right. The, the commission during my tenure implemented the pay ratio rule. But let's not look at it in, in isolation. Look at it against the entire, what I would say is compensation disclosure package, which is really about, it's 30 pages, you know, 40 pages, 20 pages in the proxy, really about how effective are compensation decisions. And somebody decided, well, let's reduce this to one metric relative to employee base. Right. That's, that's a silly metric. It was never a metric that a serious return-oriented shareholder would use in order to allocate and, capital. And mind you, from all the studies that I've So we I've tried been, to do our best with it, well, but, but it, was, it was a political metric. But one of the things I've been reading about, I mean, just in terms of studies, since the ratio has been implemented in terms of public disclosure, it has done nothing to actually reduce the ratio between the highest paid person in the company and, and the bottom paid person. In fact, that's only gotten wider. What do you make of that? Because it's, it's a, for, for any serious shareholder, right. serious institutional shareholders who dig into pay packages, alignment and the like, it's just not a relevant metric. Do you, okay, and then I want to go to the, the, the climate piece of this. Do you think that, hey, at the top level for the, for the CEO and the like, mm -hmm. is market-based? Do I think that pay is market-based? Pay is market-based. So I'll tell you why, why I'm asking the question. Mm -hmm. If I'm going to go hire somebody tomorrow mm -hmm. to work for me, typically I want to pay them enough to incentivize them to come work for me, sure. for them to do a good job in the job, mm -hmm. but not more than I would otherwise have to in any other capacity. Okay, right? that's, okay? That, yeah, but that's, 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 how, that's how a normal person thinks about how to hire someone to pay them. Okay. In the context of CEOs, and mm -hmm. CEOs in particular, mm -hmm. It is not clear to me, if we were to go down the list of the CEO pay of the top 50 people uh, in America today, mm -hmm. it is not clear to me that there is some other job available to them that would pay them more. Like, even Do you close. Do Elon Musk makes okay. so much? Okay, okay. Let, let, me, let, let, me, let, me, let me respond to that. Because, so, uh, so because, it's, because it's one way There's to a real question. It. There's no market for these people and that it's all some kind of club. That's, that's the argument. Okay, I, that, that's an that's a, like, interesting argument. Yep. But it's like having a center on a basketball team. Okay. You have a great center on the basketball team. You're paying them to get them there. What if, what if they leave? How much are you going to have to pay Joel Embiid? By the way, slide. how much are you going to pay to replace that, him? That's a, no, look, no, that's a true market. That Joel, but, but then, there's a market for him, mm -hmm. and there are other teams that would pay more for him. There's a market for CEOs. What, about, you what see, about for, like, Elon Musk? Because he doesn't fit into that paradigm. Totally. I, I, I it's think, a very interesting question. I think that question. company is entirely no, reliant. But, but, it's but, but, a very but interesting question. Don't, I don't know the answer. You're, you're, you're asking a lot of questions, but you're missing one, which is okay. you have somebody who's functioning really well. Yep. Okay? Okay. What is it going to take to find somebody who There's a can, risk premium, of course. Gigantic. I, yeah. I mean, look, uh, uh, you have people on the, you have people on the, these I'm shows. I'm just saying that most people in America, the reason why they look at CEOs and their pay you're, packages, you're, you're, unlike, a, unlike a basketball player or a baseball player, where you can see that there's a market. I can tell you Michael Jordan, uh -huh. I would argue, deserves every cent he's ever been paid and probably deserves more. You can see every shoe that's sold. You can, you, I mean, it's, it's you, I, I got you, very but just easy give, to give, give me, do it with Jennifer me, Lawrence. Give, give, can you do it with... Absolutely, because if, if the money, either the movies... I think you know the answer. The either answer the movie makes money or doesn't make money. I think the answer is there there. Are some old boy networks still around where guys are overpaid and they, they stink? And, and then there are other CEOs that are even underpaid for how good they let are. Me give and it, you can see what's happening at Boeing you're, right now. You're looking at this as a spot market. It's not a spot market. There are phases of being a CEO. When you come into the job of one of these large multinational companies, 
You know, you, it, no matter how many jobs you've had, right. it takes a year or two to get your sea legs. And then you're performing and dire directing the co company in the direction you see, understanding all right. the things. To think of that as a spot market is... I wouldn't is, think of it as a spot market. I'd think of it this way. But, and I won't name names. There have been people who've gone from, let's say, the COO or CFO to the CEO, mm -hmm. okay, in their respective roles. Right. Where they're getting paid two, three, four million dollars a year in the COO or CFO role, mm -hmm. okay? And then all of a sudden they get to the CEO role 12 months later. Mm -hmm. And all of a sudden, the number is $22 million well, or $25 million. But you're, but And it's not clear to me, me though, that, that there is some other company in America that wants to pay said person $25 million. Look, we, we, can, we can debate the gross amount, but let me talk about that step up. Let's, let's say that what you're looking for is an internal candidate at a company. Mm -hmm. You want that carrot to be there to keep those people uh, in that job. Agree. So that's step up. Assuming that they're not going to go work with you at Apollo where you could make $20 million, by the way. Uh, so there are places where you can make a lot of money. The question is, can you make that much money? And that's, look, that's as, the question. As an investor, I, I want to see the, the very best compete to become the leader of the company. And then I want to see them long-term aligned with the shareholders. I mean, do you think... A really good CEO can be just as good at what he's. I don't think you think any of them are that great. It can be just as good as what he's doing as a like a really good lefty left-hander, where you need to be able to to start in your starting rotation. Those guys make eighty million a year. Totally. Don't you think it's possible a CEO that runs a business so well, no screw up, makes thousands of decisions every day, employees counting on him, customers counting on him. I think there's some great on. CEOs in the world. Really? By the way, I you don't think, think anyone founders, else would I think hire founders them. are a very different story, by the way. That's the other thing I was going to say. Well, if you founders found a company, use stock and they, they use stock I, in I the I think beginning. the bigger issue is it, it, it's got to be tied to performance, right? And, 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 and that's where I think the questions lie. If you are doing well while your shareholders are doing well and your employees seem ha happy, then that's uh, pay for I, performance. I, I but a lot of this is the stock I, compensation plans that... It depends. Look, it depends I, I love enough. people that are locked in for the long term to the stock of the company, and even, even after they retire.